help you? Yeah, I'm looking for a wedding dress for a friend. Of course you are, sir. You'd be surprised. We're quite used to men buying for their friends. Nope. I like that one. Good choice. I estimated Gwen's size from the hub security laser scans. As you know, my dad was a master tailor. He could size a man's inside leg measurement by his stride across the shop threshold. Ah, oh, the family eye. Remind me to test it sometime. Well, if uh, later on... Jack! Yeah, brilliant. Like that one. We got a problem. Look what our friend was hiding. With that? OK, we need to get to Gwen before the Nostrovite does. We might not have a chance to get back to the hub, and the microtron weighs about two tons. Uh, that thing kills people? I saved Martha with it. Lucky shot. Listen, you two, you better start trusting me, OK? I've been working on it, and I reckon I've got it sussed. Besides, with that nostril bite around, we really don't have too many options. He's got a point. What is it with you? Ever since Owen died, all you ever do is agree with him. I was brought up never to speak of the dead, even if they still do most of the talking for themselves. OK, Owen, but well, you better be sure you know what you're doing. Oh. You wouldn't see that dead man dance, Tosh? Come on. Mind if I cut in? Why not? I'm danced off my feet. I'm gonna find a beer. Enjoy the honeymoon. I will. <laughs> what will you do while I'm gone? Ooh, the usual. Pizza, mm. Yanto. <laughs> Save the world a couple of times. Will you miss me? Always. Reese is a lucky man. A perfect husband. He's loyal. Brave. Mm, he's got a hell of a swing on him. <laughs> Best of all, he really loves you. I know. May I, um... <clears throat> yes. 